Aylred was born in 1109, of a family which had long been treasurers of the shrine of Cuthbert of Lindisfarne at Durham Cathedral. While still a youth, he was sent for education in upper-class life to the court of King David of Scotland, son of Queen Margaret. The king's stepsons, Simon and Waldof, were his models and intimate friends. After intense disillusion and inner struggle, Elred went to Yorkshire, where he became a Cistercian monk at the Abbey of Riveau in 1133. Elred soon became a major figure in English church life. Sent to Rome on diocesan affairs of Archbishop William of York, he returned by way of Clairvaux. Here he made a deep impression on Bernard, who encouraged the young monk to write his first work, Mirror of Charity, on Christian Perfection. In 1143, Aylred led the founding of a new Cistercian house at Revesby. Four years later, he was appointed abbot of Riveau. By the time of his death from a painful kidney disease in 1167, the abbey had over 600 monks, including Aylred's biographer and friend, Walter Daniel. During this period, Aylred wrote his best-known work, Spiritual Friendship. Friendship, Aylred teaches, is both a gift from God and a creation of human effort. While love is universal, freely given to all, friendship is a particular love between individuals, of which the example is Jesus and John, the beloved disciple. As abbot, Elred allowed his monks to hold hands and give other expressions of friendship. In the spirit of Anselm of Canterbury and Bernard of Clairvaux, Elred writes, There are four qualities which characterize a friend. Loyalty, right intention, discretion, and patience. Right intention seeks for nothing other than God and natural good. Discretion brings understanding of what is done on a friend's behalf and ability to know when to correct faults. Patience enables one to be justly rebuked or to bear adversity on another's behalf. Loyalty guards and protects friendship in good or bitter times. Pour into our hearts, O God, the Holy Spirit's gift of love, that we, clasping each the other's hand, may share the joy of friendship, human and divine, and with your servant, Aylred, draw many to your community of love. Through Jesus Christ the righteous, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God, now and forever.